guys, this is part two of binding the points to the bone layer. First, we need to make sure the layer that the drawing is in is highlighted in the layers section. Now, click on the select bone icon in the bone toolbar. Choose the bone that you want to bind. Go back to the bone toolbar and click on the bind points icon. Now you can drag a selection box around the desired points or you can hold down the shift button to highlight the desired points. Then press the space bar to bind the selected points to that bone. Make sure to highlight the next bone that you want to bind with the bone select tool so that the new set of points won't be bound to the wrong bone. Then, click on the Bind Points tool to select the next set of points to bind, and press the space bar. Continue on until all the points are bound. Let's test it out. To do that, click on the Manipulate Bones icon, then click on a bone and drag it around. You should see the image move like this. It looks like it's working. Now we can animate the image in the timeline. There's actually a couple of ways to do this, though I'm just going to show one. I've advanced the red line a bit in the timeline. Then, after clicking on the Manipulate Bones tool, move to the green man some. This action will be saved in the timeline and dots will appear there. I'll just do a few movements to show how it works. One other thing about bones is that you can adjust the strength of each bone. To do this, select the Bone Strength tool, click and hold on a bone, then drag left and right to make the adjustment. You may see the image perform a little bit differently after the adjustment. And that's about it. I hope this tutorial takes some of the mystery out of using the bone layer. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to drop me a note. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!